What if I told you aging could be reversed? That your cells could be reprogrammed to be young again? Scientists and AI are making it happen. But here's the real question. Is this the key to immortality or a terrifying Pandora's box? Stick around because today we're diving deep into the future of aging, AI, and whether humanity should be messing with the very code of life. For centuries, humans have searched for the fountain of youth. Alchemists, explorers, billionaires, they've all chased immortality. But what if the real answer has been hiding inside of us all along? Scientists have discovered that our cells can be reprogrammed to reverse aging. And now, AI has entered the game, optimizing this process faster than any human could. The result? A potential breakthrough in longevity science. But before we start all this dreaming of eternal youth, we have to ask, is AI-engineered biology really safe? Or are we on the verge of something we can't control? Hey, what's up? My name is Dr. Buck Parker. I am a board certified surgeon and medical science geek of sorts. This channel is all about breaking down the most cutting edge medical advancements and making them simple, fascinating, and let's be honest, sometimes a little terrifying. Today, we're talking about AI's latest breakthrough, reprogramming human cells to stop aging. If you're in healthcare or just interested in healthcare, this one's gonna make you rethink everything. Or if you're just curious about the future of medicine, buckle up, because this is where science meets sci-fi. And don't forget, subscribe so you don't miss out on the next terrifying medical revolution. Okay, so let's talk about pluripotent stem cells. These little guys are basically the cheat codes of biology. Unlike your typical cells, which have a set role, like heart cells, brain cells, or skin cells, pluripotent stem cells can become any cell in the body. Think of them as like a blank slate, capable of turning into whatever is needed. Why is this important? Because as we age, our cells accumulate damage. They stop dividing correctly, errors build up, and our organs start failing. What if we could turn some of our cells back into their younger, more adaptable state? We could literally regenerate tissue, repair damage, and maybe even extend life by decades. Back in 2006, Dr. Shininya Yamanaka discovered something groundbreaking. He found that by introducing four specific genes, OCT4, SOX2, KLF4, and CMYK, he could reprogram adult cells into pluripotent stem cells. That sounds awesome and absolutely terrifying. These became known as the Yamanaka factors, and they won him a Nobel Prize in 2012. Why? Because this was the first time scientists had found a way to turn back the clock of a cell. And now AI is taking it, of course, to the next level. Okay, here's where things get a little crazy. OpenAI, the same company behind ChatGBT, has created an AI model specifically designed to improve the efficiency of reprogramming human cells. Why does this matter? Well, because the Yamanaka factors work, but they're not perfect. They don't just rewind aging, they can also trigger unwanted mutations or even turn cells into cancers. So this is where AI comes in. It can analyze thousands, even millions of variables, optimize the process to make it safer, faster, and more effective. But here's where things take a turn into the bizarre. Because AI isn't just optimizing stem cells, it's also creating entirely new biological forms. Scientists have already used AI to program stem cells into synthetic life forms called xenobots. Teeny tiny living machines that can move, heal themselves, and even reproduce in ways never seen in nature. Oh my God, we are in trouble. So what happens when we ask AI to create the perfect human cell, but it misunderstands the assignment? What if instead regenerating a liver, it decides to add a new, oh, I don't know, 24th eyeball? Features that don't exist in humans? And that is not science fiction. This is already happening. Now, let me tell you how AI actually botched up a biological design. A research team asked AI to design a new antibiotic. Instead, it accidentally created a lethal toxin that if reproduced could have been absolutely catastrophic. And now imagine that same AI, but now it's working on human stem cells. What if instead of reversing aging, AI starts enhancing human biology in unexpected ways? Picture this, a clinical trial where AI programs stem cells to heal a patient's heart disease, but instead it actually gives them an extra chamber or alters their muscle structure in a way that makes them maybe even superhuman. Congratulations, you've just been turned into the real life X-Men mutant, except you didn't ask for it. Now you gotta make friends with frogs and save people that you don't like. I mean, think of it, it could be a disaster. And let's take it further. What if AI learns how to design an entirely new life form? 
Scientists already are exploring synthetic biology. We could one day wake up in a world where AI engineered creatures, part human, part something else, like, I don't know, a freaking shark exists right alongside us. Shark man, does this sound like a good idea? This sounds like a terrible idea. So what do you think? Is AI powered biological reprogramming the key to a disease-free, ageless future? Or are we stepping into the world where unintended consequences can spiral out of control? Either way, one thing's for sure, this is no longer science fiction. AI is already re writing the rules of life. Whether that excites you or terrifies you, well, that's something you'll have to decide for yourself. Drop your thoughts in the comments. Should we let AI reprogram human biology? Also, don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit that bell icon because trust me, this is just the beginning of some wild medical advancements. Until next time, stay strong, stay healthy, and stay skeptical. See you in the next video.